today we are looking a demo of the pre so for uh, turning the device we have to uh, on off button here we have to connect mains over here and oxygen to this input for on we have to press it once so when we uh, screen will be on we need to make sure oxygen is disconnected and there is no connection to the inspector port so now we have ready to start the mode so this is our home screen mode button mode screen to we are starting with the bubble zip app so for bubble zip app we have to start this bubble zip app mode and we have to connect circuit as per this diagram so first we have to connect one small link to the inspector of the device to the humidifier chamber second we have to connect this heated wire circuit to the other port of the humidifier chamber and the expiratory of this uh, circuit will goes to the bubble generator and we can set pressure from here so we can set 3 to 10 by adjusting this uh, cpap rod and make sure we have to make a proper level of water as per the bubble generator now we have to connect two cables to the inspiratory limbs so first is our temperature probe so we have to make sure the mesh that part and we have to make this color and we have to just uh, press it uh, first is this uh, t connector which is connected to the near to the humidifier chamber and we have to press it properly second one this l l temperature probe is goes to the near to the patient end and we second we have to connect the heated wire adapter so heated wire has a yellow connector and again we have to match that connector and we have to press this is dual heated wire so it has again a uniform connection so we have to connect this three pin connector to the end of this circuit so we have to press it like that and this is we just uh, recap the circuit so our inspiratory from the machine will goes to the humidifier chamber and humidifier from the humidifier chamber heated wire circuit to goes to the patient and and from patient expiratory goes to our bubble generator and we can turn on the humidifier so now we have to start the uh, mode from here so now we are starting now we can control the patient flow from this knob so we can increase the patient flow as per our requirement Now, whatever the real time FIO two is deliver, we can monitor over here. So now we can uh, FIO two is just we are adding twenty one percent, and pressure which is deliver is here. We can monitor the real time pressure. So this is the delivered pressure. If we any kind of leak in the system, so it will be uh, generating audio and visual alarm, and our bubble will be be stop. So we can monitor the pre real time pressure on the screen. So if our there is no leak, it will be generating bubble and pressure whatever delivered to the lungs, it will be showing here. We can watch the oscillations from the waveform, so we can uh, check the oscillations how much the bubble is generating oscillator. We can control the alarm limit over here, so we can control the low pressure and high pressure limit from this menu. Uh, if we need to increase the FR2, we have to increase the oxygen level from these knobs. So I can increase the gradually. So it will be increase the FR2 percentage on the main screen. So if we require to high the flow, we can increase the flow from that knob. So it will be increase the FR2 percentage on the screen. so whatever the target fr2 we have to achieve we can control from this uh, oxygen flow knob if we don't require any uh, oxygen we just need to turn off the oxygen so it will be again working on a 21% uh if we need to stand by the screen first we need to turn off the oxygen knob and we need to go to the standby and we need to press the standby so this is our home screen we stand by mode thank you